Here at home, health care subsidies for permanent residents will be revised from October this year. It's another move by the government to put Singaporeans first. The subsidy for PRs in most income bands will be half what is given to citizens. The adjustments will apply to inpatient services, day surgery and specialist outpatient clinics in restructured hospitals, as well as intermediate and long-term care services. They will be made in two phases. In the first phase, which kicks in from October, C-Class ward subsidies for PRs earning $3,201 to $3,350 will be cut to 49%. This will be further reduced to 39.5% in April next year. This will bring it to about half of the 79% subsidy that a Singaporean gets. Differentiation between Singaporeans, between citizens and foreigners, PRs and other foreigners is something that we cannot run away from, whether it's in the area of healthcare or education and so on and so forth. Uh, now that the difference is quite marked and more stuck, I think uh, you know, Singaporeans will be quite happy to know that you know, their rights are taken care of, their needs are top-notch. But the GPC Chair for Health, Dr Lam Pin Min, feels some PRs may need help to adjust to the changes. Dr Lam hopes the Ministry can set up a special fund to help PRs who cannot afford their medical bills and have nowhere to turn to for support. The Health Ministry says it is mindful of the impact that subsidy adjustments will have on lower income PRs. For example, PRs who earn $3,200 and below will see only a 5% reduction in their subsidy for C-class wards in public hospitals from 60% to 55% starting from October this year. For the intermediate and long-term care sector, the subsidy adjustments will be implemented in the third quarter of this year.